the numbers and stuff can turn the way it red. Play. Because we're thinking about getting everybody together for a uh, for the coffee shop. Go to the coffee shop and, and, and go to the chalet and go tobogganing and hang out with a double fireplace. Ooh, that sounds like a lot of fun. So yeah. we're going to go there and take a little video of it. What we can, as, as close as we can get to it. I don't, I don't, it's not open until November 11th, I think it is, <laughs> when it opens. Yeah. So what, when do you plan on doing it? I haven't come up with a date yet. We need to... Oh, oh we have to wait till it snows? What time do no, you know when No, no, it's a, it's a refrigerated toboggan run. Oh, seriously? So even when there's no snow, as long as the temperature is, is 50 or below, oh. then we can toboggan. And there's a double run, double toboggan run, 70 feet. Wow. <laughs> yeah. That was fun going over that covered bridge. I, I don't see any in the Well, there's not many. I don't think there's any in the area I'm at. Yeah, you can turn this like this when you're <laughs> well, saying stuff like that. I don't like want that. it on me. <laughs> I'd rather it be on you. You turn to me when I'm talking and turn to you when you're talking. That's how they. That's how you can do that. Here's the chalet. There's the chalet. Sign. Oh, the sign. here's the... I think the gate's open. You can drive up there. Chalet. Video take this because you might chase us out. Hi, I'm Zen Archer. Of course, this is Tower 916 from Zen Live Radio. And we're thinking about putting together just a little get-together. Some of our friends and... Not many. However many want to come. And we are at the Cleveland Metro Parks at something they call the Chalet. And what the Chalet is, is a big building that has uh, picnic tables all around it, like that, in the Cleveland Metro Parks. And of course, there's a nice little stage area, as you can see right here. You do a little dance there, too? And I, I just might do a little dance there. There's the stage. and. There's no no seating out here though. It's just, you just kind of gotta stand around. And uh, huh? Well, there's an idea. And of course, there's um, wood. Wood. There's wood right there. Is oh, wood. wood. Okay. We have wood and more picnic tables and stuff like that. I don't think this is normally up. But what we're gonna show you is the coolest part of this. The coolest part of this and why we're thinking about having it here at least to start the weekend we're going to have it here and the coolest part is this is a 70 foot toboggan run that oh, starts wow. all the way up there now there's no lift you actually have to carry the sleds up there yourself oh you do yeah 40 oh. the sleds are 40 pounds and so it takes a couple of people to carry them and carry up there is 70 foot that starts up there and comes all the way down Whoa. right over to here and you can watch your friends and family puke as they go past <laughs> the, the, the two the two ramps here and it goes all the way down all the way down there which is where you get off your sled and then you tote it back up here and carry it again Sled. Four people to a sled. You can put as many as now you can do. You can do uh, two, three, or four people on a sled. Isn't that cool? Yeah. And the the fireplace and stuff. You can see the uh, you can see the, the woodwork and the chimney sort right here, and oh. it's right inside this wood so atrium can, right here. So you can look out these windows when people are coming out. Exactly. Or, or are the trees in the way? Yeah, like you you can look out the windows. You can see the sledders go by and. Uh, you know, get some, uh, I get a hot beverage, some nachos and cheese or a hamburger or all that kind of stuff. Oh, Is, isn't that, cool. that awesome? And it's cheap. It's not, a, it's not an expensive place to come. It's uh, a oh, yeah, an outdoor, outdoor fireplace as well. Right there is the outdoor fireplace. Yeah, and they're, they're open like all, they're open like all weekend. And uh, we come down here, we'll hang out, we'll do some tobogganing, we'll get up a couple burgers. Hell, maybe we'll just do a cookout. And then later on in the evening, who knows, maybe we'll go to a karaoke bar or we'll go out to dinner and uh, just make a day of it. There's a lot of, a lot of um, hotels and motels around, price range from 
$50 a night up, and uh, there's Ramadas, Hotel Sex, those kinds of things. Um, all kinds of clubs, steakhouses, and stuff like that. You can always go to Spud Nuts. You can always go to Spud Nuts. In the morning, we all go to Spud Nuts for breakfast and fill the place up. Wouldn't that be something? So it'll be a hell of a weekend. It's your, it, it's, it's on you getting here to Cleveland, but the Cleveland Airport, Cleveland Hopkins Airport, is five minutes away from here. No more than that. If need be, we might be able to get a, get somebody to shuttle back and forth and that kind of stuff. Oh, or, boy, and then if anybody wants to go shopping, there's all kinds of shopping. We're not doing shopping. Oh, come on. We're not doing shopping. shopping. Oh, and I believe, I'm not positive, but I believe that there's also hay rides. And oh, I think you like would it. do the hay rides in those things right over there. Now, this is going on YouTube oh, tomorrow geez. morning. Matter of fact, you might go on YouTube tonight. <laughs> so we're going up to uh, Buffalo Wings Grill and Bar right here. Tower 916. All right, so I don't have to tell you where I'm at because you saw us come in here. But we're sitting here and it's like really, really dark, right? And well, I'll let I'll let Tara tell you what happened because I am charmed. So I was sitting there looking at the menu, and he couldn't see it very well. Then all of a sudden, the lights came on. <laughs> yeah, I just said the universe is very, very good to design. So I'm sitting here, I can't see, I've got my glasses on, I'm squinting, and I'm like, you know, I need light. And all of a sudden, oh, the light came on. <laughs> the minute you asked for light. The universe is very, very good to the Zen. I get it, I got it. Oh yeah, this is nice. This would do, this would do perfect. Yeah, that's uh, probably all we do, all we all we really need is it's, it's primarily a taste of uh, independent artists. I don't know, Savage, Savage, what do you think? You think this will work? Misty? Yeah, this is like, and we got a bar over here. I'm sorry, Mike. Got a bar over here. Oh yeah, this is yeah, this is this is good. So if you think that that's something that you would like to do, come and visit with Tara 916 and I for uh, just a weekend, just to kind of hang out and have fun, meet one another in real life and uh, all that kind of stuff, by all means, let us know. All you have to do is message to Zen Live Radio Talk radio at that makes you think. Zen Live Radio at gmail.com. <laughs> Just send us a message and let us know when you when, you know that you'd like to be to be notified or and we'll come up with a date and see if we can put that together for you.